Hey everybody, this is Andrew from Androidnica.com, your source for Android news, app reviews, and tips. I was just about to go to bed, but when I was checking my email, I got an invitation from Beehive for their Android app. Now, this is an instant messaging app that you can't get just yet because you have to be part of the beta, but hopefully it'll come out soon. So here's a quick look at what you can expect when you finally do get it. This is an instant messaging app, like I said, and it supports several protocols. You can do AIM, Facebook, Google Talk, ICQ, Jabber, MSN slash Windows Live, MySpace, and Yahoo. And it's presented to you very well. I really like this interface. It's probably the best I've seen. Yes, uh, I think it's better than Trillion as well. Uh, just This is my Facebook chats that I can do, uh, my Yahoo contacts, I mean my, uh, what's it called, AOL contacts. These are my Google Talks. And when I have a chat windows open, I can go to chats. Oh wait, wrong person. See, that's what happens when you look through the video finder. I click on the chats tab, and just like that, it shows me who I'm talking to at the moment. I can click on one of them, and then see, just like that, I get the conversation. And if I want to reply, uh, I can do it by voice note, I can send a file, or I can just say something. I tap on it and say, oh, blah, 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 blah. If I abandon the message, and then let's say I want to save this chat log, I can press menu, email chat, and then it'll bring up Android's save feature. So I can send this to Gmail, I can send it to an SMS, or I can even share it with uh, a Twitter app or something if you want to violate somebody's privacy. Uh, like I said, I can send a photo or a file and I can close the chat right there. Uh, when I pull this little thing down, it switches to the next conversation that I can go to. So I'll go to that conversation and I say, oh no, let me go back. And I can also browse my buddies. I can see what it is. When I long press on somebody, I get the option to block them if I decide not to uh, yeah, stuff like that now like I said this isn't available for regular consumption yet you've got to be part of the beta but if you are um, check your email if you registered for it before you should see something there uh, otherwise just wait for it to come out uh, Beehive looks very good I think this will eventually be the better instant messaging choice and uh, oh yeah the last thing when it's running there's like a little notification but uh, button in the notification tab I click on that and it brings me to all my open chats. So if I get an incoming chat from somebody, it'll I can get back to it easily if I'm in an app. Let's say I'm in messaging, I'm trying to send somebody a message, blah blah blah, like oh no, I gotta get back to Beehive. This is Andrew from Andronica.com giving you a quick look at Beehive for Android. Um, come by for our other reviews, tips, tutorials, news posts. We do a lot of coverage, Andronica.com. Uh, excuse me, I'm tired. It's, it's late at night. That's A N D R O I N I C A dot com. Once again, A N D R O I N I C. No wait. Oh, oh crap. I'm going to bed, man. It's it's written in the text. Enjoyinga dot com.